Johnny Boy Strikes Back. Are you still there? I gotta tell you, working at Blockbuster's difficult, but we can make it happen, toots. Why don't you come in my face? Okay, that was reverse psychology. So? You said to come on you, and I don't mind coming once, but I might come twice on you. I'm just kidding. So what you gotta do is you gotta sell the fucking popcorn and the drinks yeah, to these customers. I do. So you're saying I have to sell more soda? Crikey. Oh, and you gotta tell them about the late fees, so they don't act like they don't know, but even though they know, they'll still act like they don't know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> Oh, Miss Johnson, I forgot to tell you to buy candy and soda because it makes the movie better and junk food is delicious. It's really good. I'll be just fine with spiced rum and foreplay. Martin's just been really naughty this week. Oh, uh, is Martin your son? Who's been bad? No, you silly kike. Martin is my husband who I have to punish this weekend. Oh, well, uh, I'm sure you have your problems, but there's no need for that. Uh, problems definitely have to have better solutions. And then and, and everybody has one. Well, you're sweet. I will buy some popcorn to put up his butthole. Uh, I put kettle corn up his ass. It's, uh, his favorite flavor. But enough butt play. Have you seen this movie Home Alone? No, that movie looks stupid. Now, Kindergarten Cop, that's a good movie. Arnold's my favorite. Oh, really? Who is your daddy and what does he do? Do all your customers talk about foreplay in the comedy section? Mm, yes, they do. And I just sold a bag of popcorn to go in her husband's butthole. Hey, I love you for that. Dubs.